Sunday service on a roll. Sunday service on a roll. Sunday service on a roll. Message. The topic at hand. Ayahuasca. <laughs> the mother. Ayahuasca. Ayahuasca. Explain to the people what ayahuasca is and how it can benefit them on their spiritual plight. Man, ayahuasca is a vine. You know, ayahuasca is a brew, you mm. know, of multiple things. It's not just one thing. You know, it's a misconception that it's just one thing. Mm. And um, it comes from, you know, South America, Peru type energy. And it's, it's something that you, you combine two things, uh, MAOI, which is an inhibitor, and the vine, okay? Now, if you just drank ayahuasca, just the vine by itself, it wouldn't work. You, mm -hmm. all, you always have to accompany it with uh, MAOI. I forget the, uh, the acronym, but the last letter is the I, which is inhibitor. And it's mm -hmm. telling your body let the, you know it's telling that inhibitor is telling your body to stop breaking things down mm. okay so it's allowing this vine to reach your different parts of your body you know what i'm saying and as you as the dmt moves into your different cellular structures it interacts with it in a crazy way in a beautiful way and um the benefits wow <laughs> The benefits, wow, I just got a call, excuse me. Mm -hmm. uh, the benefits is crazy just because, I mean, the medicine is set up to purge you. You know, mm -hmm. when you get into the science of the way your body detoxes itself, mm -hmm. you know, your eyes water, you may throw up, you may sweat, you know, uh, you may have to take a, a number two, you may have to pee, you know, you may you know, have these, uh, you just think about all of the ways your body detoxes. These are some of the ways ayahuasca will purge you. Not necessarily all at the same time, but as you release these different uh, toxins within these different systems, you'll realize that that system, your body is enhanced. You know, as your eyes water, you're also seeing more colors, more spectrums of the light. You know, mm -hmm. as you throw up, you know, when you think about think about as above, so below, there's, you know, your digestive tract is it's like another another brain. You know, it's it's your gut feeling that intuition. There's neurons in the stomach. And as you release this throw up, you know, it's symbolic to a spiritual release, mm -hmm. a spiritual exorcism. It's, but physically you're releasing this bile that's been you know clogged up and as you release and push that out your body you know everybody said oh i feel so much lighter mm -hmm. i feel so much so freer i can you know they they breath get deeper you know they they voice get clearer you know and you know it's it's so it's so many directions you have to go once you start talking about the benefits mm -hmm. because this is a mind medicine you know, it's a psychoactive medicine, psychos meaning mind, you know, working with the, the universe within you, you know, the mind is all, the universe is mental. As you get into the psychoactive medicine and you start organizing and, and reassessing and asking these questions to your mind and you get these answers, you, you have these groundbreaking breakthrough experiences but it's a purging process, the shadow work that happens first, which is the what drew me so much to uh, the medicine was the amount of uh, self-realization and self-actualizations that happen during this process of working with this plant. You know, mind you, this is a plant. You know, when have we ever had such a profound experience from taking tea. We take, we've had tea all our lives. You know what I'm saying? We, we study so much magic. We study so much science. 
we study so many philosophies, I've never ne necessarily taken a, some type of substance that sent me straight into the science of three, six, and nine. You mm -hmm. know, the science of uh, the symbols of the unit, you know, the numbers. You know, people see these shapes when they tap into this medicine, not knowing that, you know, this, this sacred geometry and the Fibonacci sequences and the golden ratios are all tied in mm -hmm. as you're taking this tea. So it's like, well, what do we have here then? You know, what's going on? So as, you know, my students go from one ceremony to the next, they compound on each other. You know what I'm saying? One said the first ceremony typically being subtle, right? The second ceremony being a little bit more different than that, because you know, at you know, if you were in Peru, you you know, be taking it every night, you know, a little bit every night, you know, three nights in a row. So as they move into their second ceremony, is 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 more, it's a different classroom, and then they move into the third ceremony, it's a different classroom. Mm -hmm. And what's going on is as you're purging, you're realizing that you're becoming lighter and your frequency is changing. And mm -hmm. as, you, as you're becoming light and your frequency starts to change, you realize that you fit in different doors now. You know, you're light, en you're light enough and, and you're tuned in, in into a different frequency to the point where you have access to more than you had before. And it's just like a beautiful, uh, uh, it's, it's a beautiful symbol of as above, so below, because as you're purging physically, spiritually, you're purging as well. you're purging as well, and as you're working on your physical, you're getting stronger in the spiritual as well, and it's just it just continues to keep going there. Like the extra sensory perception, as your clairvoyance, your intuitions, you realize that as you're clearing these different spiritual bodies and clearing and detoxing these different physical bodies, that the duality to that is you're becoming a monster in the fucking spiritual. Mm. As you start, see the, the medicine not set up where it's also instant upgrade. It's you no, know, you have to work on this shadow work, you know, as this medicine is unraveling you mm. and you're using sound to help you. You're bound by sound as this medicine unravels you, as you play this specific music, tuned to a certain hertz at a certain cadence, you know, as you start unraveling yourself, there's different toxins that's being released, not knowing that there's memories in these toxins. Mm -hmm. As you're releasing these toxins and these visuals and these, these different traumas come up, mm -hmm. you realize that, that I'm really tapping into this medicine that's bringing up these different traumatic experiences. Now, what people have to understand is the psychology to life almost that it's these situations that hold us back mm -hmm. from these different um, level ups, is, is these different prosperities, these different things that, you know, we have already come into us as we start facing our demons and facing these different situations, facing the things that nobody sees that only we know as we start mm -hmm. facing those things, our life is magically changing be before our eyes. And this, this is, these are some of these tools that you can take and it's, it's happening, it's cracking. There's just, you're not getting past it. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, there's no way around it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's something that I've brought to the forefront because I realized that our people are fucking PTSD in the hood right now. Thanks. My cousin got shot more than six times. If he hears a gun, what do you think is going? Is his psyche is he's going to go into that shock? Right. If he got shot, it's, it's listen. This is why you get into the medicine and you help bring these things to the uh, the forefront. Like you have to deal with why you're even here. You know, this is considered the mother of all plants. You know, this is a motherly energy that's gonna sit up here and be real direct with you, son. You know, it's gonna be real direct with you. This is what's going on with you. Yeah. And you're gonna, you're gonna either have to get with it or you're gonna sit exactly where you at. And it's, it's said to you in such a nurturing, direct way mm. that 
you'd be like, damn, I can definitely feel the hug as my mama said that to me. Mm-hmm. You feel me? And and that's why they, you know, it's every time somebody tap into the mother, they say, I ran into this female, this feminine energy. That's consistent. This is a spirit work here. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah. Powerful, David. Powerful. You may shit. I'm a hot shit. <laughs> we gotta go to Georgia, babe.